Halloween is just around the corner, so this next story seems almost fitting. It seems spiders, yes, spiders, are causing some big issues for some western New York drivers. In fact, one viewer tipping us off that her car became partially flooded from a spider infestation clogging the air conditioning tube. Now, there's a well-documented history of spiders messing things up for drivers, leading to widespread recalls. But as 7 Eyewitness News reporter Dave Thompson tells us, there are some things you can do to stave off an eight-legged invasion. And it is one of those things that people just freak out over. Several Western New York drivers have found some unwanted passengers in their cars. They'll be along the edges inside the doors. Sometimes they'll be up in the crannies around the edges of the doors and up along uh, the rail inside the vehicle here by the windows. With cold weather coming, spiders have been making their homes in cars across the region. And Phil Basinski, owner of Sweeney's Garage in the town of Tonawanda, says drivers want nothing to do with their eight-legged co-pilots. We have had a few people that say they were not willing to drive the car if they had any sense that there was a spider anywhere near them. Basinski thinks he's been seeing these guys, yellow sack spiders. The critters force car makers, including Mazda, Honda, and Toyota, to issue recalls. It's believed the spiders were building webs in the vent line from the fuel tank, which could cause a fire. But at Sweeney's Garage, they've come up with a battle plan. Take the chlorine packet and we'd set it on the center console, activate it with some water. The garage has had success with a chlorine bomb, as Bazinski calls it, a package of chlorine that is often used by dealers to remove odors. But he's found it gets rid of the spiders as well. In the inside of your, of your vehicle will smell like uh, the, the swimming pool in your high school. That's how strong the chlorine smell is. But it'll dissipate very quickly, and evidently that chlorine is strong enough where it'll kill any living thing inside the car. The chlorine bomb will set you back about $30, but Basinski says some customers just want to be rid of their guests. They want them out of there. They don't care what it takes, and they just want them gone. Dave Thompson, 7 Eyewitness News.